You go to amp we rolling with. It can be a two, three, or four channel amp, 1200 watt max, which I ain't even gonna need all that. I just went a little overboard, just in case later down the road, you know, I wanna add a sub or something. You know, you got the bass knob. There you go. But everything I use, I'm gonna link down in the description if you wanna check anything out. But now we're about to throw this in, wire everything to this, and get going. You go to ends. This is where you run all your speaker wire. As you can see, let me see if it'll zoom in. There you go. You can bridge it if you want. So, then there go your positive. This is the big four gauge wire that's running to your battery. Here go the blue wire we was talking about before. That's your uh, control wire that goes to the radio, to the amp. It's that blue wire. Here go your ground. You'll run the ground to like any good metal piece on the chassis somewhere in the trunk, find you a good raw metal spot, grind it into here, then screw it on to the uh, body part. I'm gonna show you where I'm gonna do mine. I'm gonna do mine like behind the seat where it's just raw metal at back there. You go to the other side, you got your base control knob right here. Then you got your RC inputs. That'll be that you ran with the power wire. That's connected to the back of the radio. That's where these are, RCs. So let's finish this up. So right now we got the back speakers all wired up like I should. Like I said, I was going to run them in parallel. So these two is going to be the back passenger. Them two over there will be ran as the back driver's side. Have them run in parallel. So now it's time to wire everything up to the amp. So now we just got to run our nine wire cable. We got to run it into the front, right, front, left, you know, such and such, such and such to each speaker. You go to blue. It's the blue wire. Remember the blue wire go to the amp. That'll be going right here to the power on amp. You're going to run this to the ground, of course. And this will be positive will be big, thick blue cable. Let's wire this up. And of course you got your RCAs that plug into this side. So this is where I ran the ground, took the back seat down, ran a self-typing screw to ground the amp down. This was like the factory old school for the back seat speaker back in the day. That's where they had it grounded at. It's kind of cool. But ground it down. About to finish wiring everything up. See if we can check this thing out. It's getting late. Hear some sound for a little bit. All right, so we got everything. All right, so we got everything wired up. Let me see. Turn this around. I'll show y'all. Everything is all wired up. Two front speakers. Since these were going straight to uh, these kick panels I installed, they was new speakers. I didn't have to use the the front wires out of the nine wire. I just ran them straight to the kick pound speakers. But everything else, nine wires, they're all hooked up, running to the back, these to the back speakers. You go your RCAs, to the back of the radio. And like I said in the previous video, if you ever want to just like, like I got them wired up to the ignition, so when I turn my car on, it, uh, the radio and everything comes on, and I also ran like a toggle switch to it. Let me see. Also ran like a toggle switch. To the sounds that way like say if i'm at a car show indoor car show i just want to leave my car chilling with like some oldies or something playing i can just hit the switch only thing it'll turn on is the radio and that's it no other accessories i won't have to leave my keys in the car or nothing like that so but i'm gonna go all right everything is ran to the amp as you can see and on this side whoop, on this side we got all the wires Going into the jacks, they go to the ground right there. And I gotta make a, uh, I'm gonna make a platform for this to kind of sit up straight on. But for right now, we're just checking everything, make sure everything is good. I gotta put the male to female connectors on these. Check it, make sure everything good. Set y'all up right there. So I got this phone. I always use like I just I just keep music on it. Um, that way I ain't got to use my phone and stuff like that. Just keep music on one of my 
It's an old spare phone I had. I got music laying around to it. So let's see. Let's see what we got. So bring you. So like I said, you can run the toggle switch to it. See a light up, so you know you got power. So right now, just the radio should power on. No accessories, no no nothing. This is just for this. No key and ignition, nothing. So let's see. There you go. You got power. It's all dusty. Look at all this dust. Come on in. All right, so I got my spare phone. I keep all my music on. I'm going here. Let's see, find some music to play. I don't care about none of them, none of that copyright stuff, man. We just gonna, we gonna play something, you know what I'm saying? Everybody be too worried about the, oh man, I can't play this because I'm gonna get flagged and this, man, fuck all that shit. Let's find something to play. Uh, let me see. Let's see what's all on this. All right, so bring y'all down here. Everything wired up. I gotta put it back in the deck and all that. Like I said, I wired it to a toggle switch. That's that way. If I just want to be at a show and just walk away from my car, leave music playing. Don't gotta leave my keys in the ignition for my accessories to be on. You can also run a spare toggle switch that it just turned just your radio on that's it so let's see this should be good there you go you got light so that's gonna got power going to it let's make sure the radio's on yep got power to the radio let's make sure we got power to the amp got the blue light on on the amp now, if you had like a red, like if it went red or something, then you definitely got something wired up wrong. But this will have a blue, some might have a green. This will happen to have a blue, so let's go back in and go see. Back up here, let's see. I was reading the manual to the. I was reading the manual to the radio. See how to hook up Bluetooth. Alright, now let's go. See if this spare phone I gotta pick it up. Then we can get some sound going. Make sure everything is wired up good before I really, you know, attach everything back, push them up, zip tie everything clean, back off in the dash all out the way. So dusty up in here. Been working around in this dash. Let's see. Search for a device. Wonder if this other phone. Here we go. Custom audio. Pairing. It's an old HTC phone. I keep a lot of music on. Okay, we good. Yep, yeah, connected. Alright, so let's see what we got. Let's play some music, see how they sound. I won't deny it. I'm a straight rider. You don't wanna fuck. So remember, both six by nines in the back. Imagine if we do kick panels in the front. This shit not. Shit down. Look, it's just super loud. It sounds super clean and crisp. Like I said, I'm running the four six by nines in the back, the two six and a half in the door speakers. I mean, not in the door speakers, but uh, kick panels. Hey, it's super it sounds super clean, man. I just gotta button everything up. Sound good. This is like an old phone. Let me see. Let's, let's pick something else to play real quick. Let's see what else I got over here.
about 25. I have no fear. But it's super loud in here. And with my beers, I'm coming up. Fools talk real loud, but don't put it on. It's by nines, hit real hard. They run it up. We still right here, so why would you think about time? And he said, because parking that shit, talking the shit from the concrete. Super when they talking the shit. If he be yours, in the bed, bitch, poke the bitch, in the throwback, hold the gas, and 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 the gas